This is delicious. Although they've only had one sitting in the restaurant, the volunteers have pulled off a competent but slow service. Smile. That's pretty good, I think. Yeah. Happy with that, guys? Oh, wonderful. Everybody has those preconceptions of Alzheimer's and dementia, and it is to do with old people and in homes, and this is completely different, and there's still people there that can do things and have sense of humour, and their personalities are still there, and you forget all of that. The food has been delicious. Wonderful. Been really all, all the food that you've done there has been prepared by people with dementia and yeah, has been served to you food. by people with yeah, dementia. Yeah, yeah. The whole experience was generally absolutely amazing. Like, the food was great, and it felt like, I don't know, somehow kind of home, in a way. And sometimes when you go out, it's so clear when the staff have training and, you know, they say certain things and act in a certain way, and these people, it just felt so normal yeah. and friendly and human. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. After service, there are jobs to be done in preparation for next week. Peter, I thought you could get back to everybody on the email. How do you feel about that? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. You could look at that and start replying to people. Yeah. Peter's Alzheimer's has robbed him of basic skills. Writing and reading, um, they're the things that have gone. I don't even know now sitting here if I'm left or right handed. Peter normally relies on voice transcription software. I haven't used a keypad like this for a long while. No? No, probably a um, couple of years. Yeah, do you know, I'm quite emotional about this. This is a bit silly, isn't it? Really? Yeah. Because it's bringing work stuff back? Yeah. Um. You okay? Yep. Mm. This is a bit soft, I'm sorry. That's all right, <laughs> it's fine. It's funny you have something simple like that, isn't it? Yeah, so what do you think? Is that triggered an old memory or something? I used to obviously run the business and do all sorts of stuff. And, uh, was it your business? Yeah, 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 it was, yeah. My father started in 1947 and I, I took it off him. Um, he had dementia and made lots of mistakes in the business. I saved the business from him when he got it in trouble all those years ago and then somebody else had to come along and save it from me because I, I made lots of errors in the business, but, um, yeah, this just brings back a lot of stuff. Not bad stuff, good stuff, yeah. What does it remind you of? It's good to be in control and respond to people again and um, talk to people about coming in and giving a service. Engagement? Yeah, engagement, which is something I haven't done for a long while. Oh, I'm a soppy old sod, aren't I, really? I think everyone is, really. Yeah, I think we are, yeah. Yeah, that was quite good. I just typed it out and it just, it just came back, just like that. Having a purpose is, is, a, is a great thing. If someone took all your jobs away tomorrow and said, you can't do this, you can't do that, you've just got to sit around and do nothing all day because you're worthless. It's, that's just not on. And it shouldn't be like that. It's not our fault. Dementia takes away many things. It takes away our memories and our abilities to do things. But what it doesn't take away is feeling. And you get so that you do things not so much with this, but more with your soul and your heart.